All right, guys, today we're going to be talking about how you can simplify i when it has a power. All right, so you're given an example here, right, and they want you to go ahead and simplify this. So when you're given i, right, and it has a power, the goal is to make the exponent even. So in this case, this works out very nice because our exponent here is even, and that's what you want. Okay, so since our exponent is even, right, we can rewrite this the following way. We can write i squared, right? And then on the outside, 6, right? That's the same thing mathematically, right? Because 6 times 2 will give you 12, right? So mathematically, this is the same. However, we just broke this apart, so it's easier to see now what's going on. We know that i squared is going to be, well, that's negative 1, right? And then to the 6th power, well, negative 1 to the 6th power is simply just going to be 1, right? And that's it. So let's try another example. Now let's try one when the exponent is not even. So let's try when the exponent is not even. So erasing this, let's try it when it is, let's try 27. Okay, in this case, right, <clears throat> if you try to do what we just did, right, so if I do i uh, squared, well, what can I put here? Well, nothing times two is gonna give me 27, right? We're looking for whole numbers here. Um, so that's not going to work. So think about how you can do this, right? Well, I can take an i out, right? So what if I do this? What if I do i, and then I have i, right? That's the same thing. So if I have i, and then I have i to the 26, right? Well, that's the same thing as i to the 27th, right? So what we can do here now is do what we were just doing. So we, we write, we have i, and I'll say here i squared, right? And then I'll put 13 here. Okay, so now, okay, we can go ahead and do this. Rewriting, we have i. i squared is going to be negative 1, okay, to the 13th. So negative 1 to the 13th power is going to be negative 1. Negative 1 times i, negative i. Okay, and that's it. So again, when doing these, when trying to simplify i when it has a power, your goal is to make the exponent even, and then you can go ahead and do your work from there. All right, and that's it.